Peary Avenue? Peary Avenue? Peary Avenue. <laughs> Pretty much anywhere else in the world, this would obviously be Pierre Avenue. But not here in Windsor. That's not how we say it. And it's not the only French street name that we have our own spin on. Grand Maris. Grand Maris. Grand Maris. Grand Marais means big marsh in French, a reference to the area's wetland geography. Our refusal to use true French pronunciations is especially puzzling considering the area's deep French-Canadian roots. The reason why so many street names in Windsor are French is because of the families that settled the area more than 270 years ago. The French regime at the time granted land parcels to clans such as the Ouellettes, the Policiers, and the Duilots. And those names persisted despite the British conquest of the area in the 1760s. But even an expert on French-Canadian folklore isn't quite sure why Windsor French pronunciations have mutated so strangely over the years. French is no longer the uh, you know, majority language there, so of course people are going to adapt uh, pronunciations uh, the way they see fit. Um, but um, there, there are some, some kind of odd ones in there, some that can be fairly easily explained, others that... Uh, kind of defy any logical explanation that I can think of. <laughs> Just how far off are Windsor pronunciations from the correct French? We asked Professor Beneteau to help us compare. Piri Avenue. Obviously, the uh, correct pronunciation would be Pierre, or, at, you know, if you don't want to roll the R's, you can say Pierre Street. I don't know what the problem is. People can say Pierre Trudeau. People can say Pierre Poilievre. Why can't they say Pierre Avenue? And Piri, I have no idea. Langlois Avenue. Okay, well, it should be Langlois. O-I in French uh, is pronounced wa. Olet Avenue. Yeah, okay, I know that one. Yeah, Olet kind of grates on my nerves. Olet's a little closer, but the thing is, so in uh, Ouellet, it should be, it should be, the O-U should be treated like a W. Polisher Street. Okay, so the E-R at the end of a word in French is pronounced A, so Pelissier. Um, why they uh, make a sh sound instead of the S sound. Um, I think it's just, uh, it just gets kind of assimilated. Pilette Road. Pilette Road. Pilette Road. It would be Pilette. Pilette. Baby Street. Baby Street. Baby Street? To be honest, I have heard Baby Street and, and uh, uh, Baby Tavern, but the, the old pronunciation is still there, and that's how it's pronounced in old French, Babi. Lausanne Road. O-N, on, on, is what is known as a nasal vowel. Um, Part of the sound comes out through your nose. Really, it's Lausanne. I know how to properly say these, but Drew Lard Road. <laughs> I double L is um, pronounced with, with a, like a Y sound. Yeah, so it should be Drouillard. Drouillard. It might be argued that Windsor's way of saying certain French street names isn't actually incorrect. It's just local. After all, nobody thinks Boblo Island is wrong because it was once Bois Blanc. And did you know the now demolished Abar's Tavern was once Ebert's Tavern? So maybe we can take some pride in our unique pronunciations. Except for the way everyone messes up Tecumseh. Dalson Chen, CBC News, Windsor.